Welcome to Live, Learn, Love, Livingston County. I am Star Greif, a local realtor with Lyon Sullivan Realty, and I'm here today with Courtney Brook, uh, Charmed Boutique in downtown Pontiac, Illinois. She owns gorgeous boutique. If you haven't been in here, definitely worth uh, coming in and checking out what she has to offer. Can you tell us a little bit more about your boutique? Um, so how I kind of got started, I went to ISU and I majored in apparel merchandising and I minored in business and the spring before I was graduating my aunt called me she lives in Louisville Kentucky and she was going to start her own boutique I had nothing lined up so I moved to Louisville and started from the ground up essentially I was part of everything except I didn't own it so I was there for almost a year my grandfather's the mayor of Pontiac and he approached us and asked if she would be willing to open her boutique here, like another location, because of Route 66. And at that time, six years ago, we really didn't have a lot of retail right. on the square. No, there wasn't. So she thought about it. We like we did some research. We went to market. She just decided, you know what, it's too much right now. She had three kids, all that. So my grandpa was like, well, you should do it. And I was like, I can't do How that. I'm you? 23 yeah, years 23. old. Like, I can't, there's no way That's I could do step, that. Yeah. 23. So I was like, if he thinks it's a good idea, I'm going to go for it. So I moved home in April of 2012, and I opened the store June 7th of 2012. So then just recently, I was able to knock down the walls and expand, which is we're sitting on the new side now. So that just tells you how much business has really, it was a great leap of faith that I took because every year gets better. In the beginning, did was it slow? It was slow, but I didn't you let it bug me. I trusted the pro I was just like, it can't, it's not going to fail. So I never like, I really never lost sleep over it. You know, I was a young, I'm still paying school loans and car loans and rent. A lot of people start businesses and don't see a profit. And you know, I luckily the locals are really, the tourists ended up being just kind of like a cherry on top. You know, it's really more locals. That's what I would prefer Yeah, because um, they're here all year. I mean, to have a shop this beautiful here in Pontiac, you yeah. wouldn't expect this even for locals. I mean, right. myself coming in, I was yeah. like, wow. I mean, yeah, it I do. really feels like a boutique. I do hear that a lot, which is a great compliment. I, but I also really like decorating things. So That's to both worlds. Yeah. And you make everybody that come in here feel glamorous, but yet it's affordable prices. Yes. So. So you've been really busy with um, stepping it up to doing online sales and stuff too now? Yes, so I've recently started a website in February and I've already seen growth in it. It's really been, uh, I'm glad I did it. Even for the locals, it's been a great Well, yeah, they get concept. like well, yeah, because, access, yeah, you know. Yeah, and you can, you know, buy something and then pick it up in store. So because boutiques, like I only get six of everything in. I could get more if I wanted, but I like to keep, you know, my inventory, my turnover is, I get new things almost every day. Um, so when it's gone, it's usually gone. That's another unique thing about boutiques. It's going to be special and one of a kind, yeah. essentially. So. Okay. Well, Courtney is offering 15% off. That was pretty awesome. Yeah, that's that's a so nice, come see me. nice discount. So check her out on the park bench profile page post a review get the coupon you can also new customers can get the coupon as well bring it in with you yeah so come so. check her out tell her that she's seen her on park bench thanks guys for watching have a good day bye